I'm Sam. It's early in the morning and it's very cold, so I'm going to be quick. Um, so the last video was a huge turning point for me, and I wanted to say a few words about that because I think you know, just to admit to myself that behind everything, this channel, you know, every successive attempt to mould myself into a new identity was you know, that need to be wanted. And just to say that over the last few days has been, I felt like a horror, but a freedom. And like I said, I'm waking up in a new reality and that reality is an awareness of it all and a liberation. Because when you're aware of what drives you, what shapes you, you can see it and create some space, some time between how that controls you and your choice in how you react to it. And that is what this whole journey has been about, creating some space within which reality can live, truth can live. And so, you know, if you're born into brokenness and you learn very quickly that you are not enough, what do you do? You shape yourself, you try to become enough. And that's what I did my whole life. So to reach this point in my age is very liberating, but it's also um, disturbing to look back on a life but I must forgive, I must forgive myself. Um, so, it's been a very intense journey, but it's really, life is only just beginning, only just beginning. So, every day I swim in this lock, unless it's too windy, because it's very rough. And um, it does feel like a metaphor for the wound because to slip into the water is, is scary for me. And um, one of my lovely subscribers wrote that maybe it's not me that enters the loch, but the loch that enters me. And I've been thinking about that for the last couple of weeks, every, every day when I've been swimming. And then I think in a very real way, the loch is, did my morning swim is a metaphor for the wound and for life. Um, Heraclitus said, everything flows. And so when I go into the water, I think of that. I think of Anna's words. And I think of Heraclitus, everything flows. Because to be moving across the surface of the water is to be at that still point between the known the seen and the unknown, the unseen, the light and the darkness. And there I am at that still point between the two. And everything flows. The sky, the water, it all flows through my awareness. The fear, the pain, the shame, the hope, the joy. It all flows. So, right, I'm going for a swim. I'll see you soon.